Hey guys, I'm Kirk. Welcome back to Star Sector. Look at those big old fleets flying around here, protecting our place. How nice. I wanted to go... Where are you? Lodic Path? Excuse me? Wh what are you doing over here? You guys, go pursue them. Smack them around. Really, Lodic Path? That's not, that's not nice. That is not nice. Anyway, uh, what I wanted to do today is go explore a bit more but for that we're gonna need more storage and i did order custom production of a couple of our caroms which are um, civilian frigates that uh, carry stuff so we're gonna get a couple of those and while i wait for those to be completed i wanted to go out of here not there but somewhere out here to go do this bounty that only has 13 days remaining to be honest but still Better than nothing. I'm pretty sure I can get there before that. So, oh, high command has been completed on Prospero. Uh, I want to see that now. Where is it? Oh, look at that. Yes, now we're going to have more fleets incoming. Perfect. And I'm building more ground defenses for everything. Basically, spend more money to just upgrade all of our stuff and build more of our stuff and just have it be glorious. You know how it is. Uh, we want it to be glorious. And another bounty, new bounty. I mean, I did say I'm going to go explore, not do bounties, so I'm going to keep an eye on that. Uh, but we should be getting those Karens in soon. Those Karens in soon. Good good job flying into that storm, though, bro. There you go. We did get them. They've been delivered to Prospero. And I need to remember to pick them up uh, at the shortest time possible. So, yeah. We, we have a lot to explore. I want to go explore. I want to get some blueprints and all that stuff. This one is low. And, well, we don't know anything about it. So, we're just going to jump in here. There's a threat. You know what? If something, we are never afraid of a threat. Well, those are the guys we want to fight. Come at me, bros. And there's some ruins out there as well. We have dealt with fleets like this many a time before. We are not afraid. We are not afraid. Oh, we cannot even put everybody in there. I'm sorry, this Interrex is going to have to wait. I guess we can switch in for the Legionary later on. I guess that's fine. Let's deploy and let's go. I'll just push up here. And you go grab this one on the way. Let's go. Yeah, we're going to just push out there. We want more of that command recovery point stuff. So uh, that's gonna be that's gonna be us. That's gonna be ours. You can grab that point, and then we go. All of the flyers that we have out here. I want to get some Scudum drones for this one as well, because I feel like you could use them nicely. Also, I can I can use this to speed up a bit. It's gonna recharge before we get out there anyway, so we're fine. Just as long as it don't blow up my ship, it's all good. Uh, you go there, and this one will let be the way it is it's, it's all good also i switched the hvd out of this one which is probably gonna give us a bit more flux in the long term but uh, otherwise please dudes what have come on why would you stop right in the middle of the track i'm coming through over here don't you see a giant ship flying behind your ass be a bit more careful dude be a bit more careful what you do all right now onwards let's go to glory Yes, indeed. Oh, you guys tried to take this thing from us, huh? Well, that's uh, not going to go well for you. Let me just tell you. That is not going to go well for you. There you go. That's the first... That's the first death of this process. And here comes the big boys. Here comes the big boys. Now, that is the ones I really want to go after. So, let's start pumping. Let's start pumping. Well, that butt went really fast. He died before I could even look at him properly. 100%. And you gotta get overloaded. There's some Mervs that got completely destroyed. Ain't that beautiful. Okay, uh, let me turn off my guns for a second. Okay, let's hit those Mervs. Okay, we're ready for this once again. Let's go. I'll start pumping on you. And you guys can start playing with stuff. Okay, we're 30%. Let's turn this one off. 
Let's go for you. I believe you had some more Murphs for me. Yes, you did. You also had some lag for me, haven't you? That's fine. Okay, there's the Harpoons. They're gonna kill this. Alright, let's, uh, let's just turn this... Oh, you're behind me, huh? How unfortunate for you. How unfortunate. But you know what? Dissipate Flux. This, uh, this system is pretty good. I love that how these Murphs don't even get through at all. How are we doing, boys, out here? We're doing great. We're doing great. Uh, we could call him in, but at this point, I don't think there is much point, really. It's, uh, everything over here is just gonna die before he can even get over here, so... There's that. Let me start pegging the big boy. You guys play with the small adventures, so I'm gonna play with the big boys. Oh, the slowdown from all these fighters. <laughs> oh my god. The lag is real. The lag is real right now. Okay, stop shooting. That's all I ask of you, my friend. Just stop shooting. Turn the system on to dissipate. And we're good. Okay, now. Let's start shooting again. And let's take care of this bad boy. And then we're gonna take care of this bad boy. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Very nice. And then we need to take care of you, but... Uh, no, it's not the time. There's so much debris, I can't even get there. The Sebastos is complaining about a broken something. This broken junk, he says. I don't know why. I don't know why you complain, bro. Alright, turn it off at 4%. That's just acceptable. Sebastos, what are you, what are you complaining about? Where is he? You're doing fine. You're doing just fine, brawling over there with some stuff, and the Ixens are doing just gloriously well. Oh, yes. Uh, look at my beautiful drones blocking all of that. Oh, that was legit. That was glorious by my drones, 100%. I like this. I also really love the turn rate now with the Elite package. And the extra speed. I think that was definitely uh, a very welcome. Addition over here. Hey, don't don't flee, you fools. Don't flee. <sighs> the explosions! Oh, the explosions. Okay, boys, just uh, leave this be. For assault. Go kill the last two floating uh, pieces of junk out there. Oh, yes. The Ixens. The Ixens are really great on that support. The missile support is amazing by those guys. Like, I just love them for that. Just the amount of missiles they have. Holy shit, yeah. Really good job, boys. Really good job. Pursue the one that got away. You know what? You can have this then now. There you go. Perfect. Supplies. Stuff. We did it. What was that noise? What was that noise exactly? Bounty completed. Colony threat. Invasion. Hegemony in 58 days. Hegemony? Alright. Uh, let's see. They are very strong. Three fleets. Okay. They are superior. And the ground forces are evenly matched. Alright. Well, we're gonna come home. We're gonna defend. It is as it should be. I wanted to explore. I guess fighting is what's gonna come. Not exploration, but fighting. And that's just gonna have to be it. But just show me what is this over here. It's a condor. What are you doing out here, condor? Okay, so there's a destination you're sending out there, huh? Somebody's trying to catch us up? Well, it would be unfortunate for those. I wanna quickly check. Oh, that fleet is coming. I wanna check this quickly, though. Uh, get a survey going. Widespread ruins. Explore that. That was pretty shit for widespread ruins but i guess we're gonna take the reaper why not and let's get out now i don't have time to fight you sorry bro i need to go fight hegemony that's gonna be coming soon ish yeah soon ish oh what is that a sensor array let's just quickly pop if there's anything in here doesn't seem to be the case 
Uh, in the preparation for this coming fight, I guess we could order... Uh, let's order maybe another... I don't know, another Sebastus then? Custom production. We could get another Sebastus. And... Uh, I don't know. Actually, it's not gonna complete it in the month that we need it, so that doesn't really mean much to us then. But I'll still do it. Yeah, it's gonna have to go into the other month, which is not gonna be made in time for uh, defense of our system, but it's gonna be okay. Uh, even even though it's gonna be okay, I believe, because there's you know we've seen those friendly friendly fleets out there that we can use. The Tritax have been there, and I've seen some Imperium guys as well, so I believe in us. Well, we do have our Legion over here, which I did put in here for defense of the, the whole colony. If we needed it, what is the concerned man doing? He wants domestic goods brought to hegemony? Yeah, about that one, bro. Don't think so. I think we're just gonna call it there. Ground defenses are being built over here. We do have the high command. Uh, we could uh, upgrade this to battle station. It's 500,000. Yeah, no. Maybe we could do this one. Battle station. Let's start the upgrades. Why not? You know, get uh, get this Prospero station a bit better. Let's, uh, let's see. We also have hegemony. <laughs> Sending an expedition to check what is going on with the uh, free port status, you know, they're somewhat weak We could uh, we could give them money for bribes and all that stuff, but you know what? Don't care. Come on in. I mean you're sending an invasion fleet anyway, so Yeah Here's that. There's a forge world Lemuria. There's our fleets flying around and about How's it going boys out here? It's the salvage fleet there's our mercantile convoy. There's the smaller boys setting up. How we looking out here? Oh, there's our detachment, the bigger one. Okay, okay. Flying about. It's good to know. It's got some officers. Nothing too big or too much. Doesn't look like uh, those other guys are still here. The uh, what shall we call them? Uh, the tri tag boys. We do have a mining fleet over here. Well, that's nice. And there's our monthly expenses. Unfortunately, <clears throat> we didn't get this one, right? We still need to uh, we need to spend like 5,000 on this one before we can get it out. But hey, that's fine. And I don't know where they're going to come in. But as you can see, there these guys have been at least defending stuff. You're not really using... The fleets that you should be using, or the ships that you should be using, but it's fine. Yeah, we might need to take that Legion out of storage for uh, the coming fights, just so we have another anvil. Let's uh, go check it just so that it's good. Just so that it's prepared for this. Yeah, Let's see that it's good. Okay, so these guys are here. On patrol duty, that's nice. Uh, so, this one, if you take it. What does it have? It's got compromised armor, increased maintenance, which is none too amazing. But it's got a uh, Hephaestus, a uh, Gauss cannon over here, some annihilators, flak up front, a bunch of Vulcans, fun days. Okay, okay, that's that's fine. It's got a longbow, trident. Tri okay, we have some solid bombers for sure, and some claw fighters, recovery shuttles. And hardened shields could get you an ITU instead of shields, but sure, you know what? You gonna be a tank. You need good, good shields. I don't even know if these ones will do okay over here, but uh, maybe. You know, this is why I like the 14th Battle Legion because I believe the 14th you can put uh, missiles on the big ones, if I remember correctly. And this one is just a fun day, huh? Uh, sure, I guess. You can have those annihilators up front, flak over there. I mean, why not? The fighters are going to be your main thing uh, if we need you. So for now, I'm just going to store it. Uh, if you need to bring it out, we'll bring it out. We still have 29 days before these guys come over here. So 
Still got plenty of time to fly around. And actually we'll get our Sebastas in time. So that's good. There's a bunch of Ixens flying around. Not all the ships are... What do we want? Uh, excuse me, who is out here? Pirates? Excuse me, pirates. What do you do here? Friends? <laughs> you are gonna die now? Yes. Deploy all my officers. You know what? You guys can be a very nice uh, preamble before we have to uh, fight the bigger hegemony fleets. Why not? Freaking invaders. We're gonna smack you all. I mean, I don't know what they're doing here, what the pirate courser is trying to achieve, but we don't take kindly to no pirates around here. Oh, no, no. We don't take kindly to that. But the the speed boost from this is pretty nice from my system. I am still kind of slow, of course. I was happy with how much my Sebastus could tank against pirates. Of course, fighting the hegemony is going to be a whole different thing. It's hegemony ships are not going to be made of paper like uh, those were out there from the pirates. So, I mean, I think I can actually request my allies to come help. So I'm going to take a look at that and see what happens yeah you're just you're just dead bro you're just dead bro you want to get out there get out of my way you you silly bitties we should go onwards to glory onwards to glory there you go start fighting don't get in my way dude don't get in my way oh well uh this does not need to be here just Push out there, boys. Fight. Whatever needs fighting. There you go. And I shall focus. How are you already almost dead? I guess they might have been fighting some of my other fleets already. That would be my guess. Uh, I don't know why I turned my shields off, by the way. I just did, because I liked it. And... Turn it off. A 2%. <laughs> yeah, that thing is dead. Good stuff. Okay, they do have a bunch of fighters incoming. They shall perish. Just like everybody else over here is. Alright, start poking. Let's turn on the system, start poking. Let's get this one going as well. Let's get you going as well. The missiles are going in there. Yep, this was... Uh, they were dead before they could have done anything else. You gotta love these Empire ships. I mean, I'm loving them right now. We'll see what happens once we uh, fight the hegemony. Because that's gonna be a bit more problematic. There you go. Good kill. Okay, so that... I gotta admit. Those Ixons are doing work. 100%. There you go. That's what you get. Persian League. Trader just chilling in here. Good. It's a Colossus. Don't need none of that. But we'll take all of your resources. Thank you very much. And let's go bring all that back home somewhere. Remnant raid failed. I don't know why they tried to raid, but uh, they did fail it. And uh, let's go and once again store all the goodies while we wait. So we do have some of these bad boys running around here. Very nice. You guys are exactly who we needed. Good to see. That's a Paragon. Oh, good, good, good. Some Astrals. A lot of Dooms. <laughs> nice to see. And did I see one of our uh, grow right now? One of our colonies? Or was it somebody else? I think Ashcor has grown. And Ashcor is now making a lot of monies. Uh, you know what, Ashcore? We don't have the money right now to do anything, but I think I would upgrade you to military base for the next industry slot. Like, we could do more, you know, stuff, uh, commerce or whatever to make money, but I just want to make this a military place, you know? That was the goal this whole time. Uh, so, you know, that's good to hear. I'm just gonna pop out of the system quickly, just to see if we have anybody coming in anytime soon. Should be a week now. Actually, we will be getting that Sebastus in a week. So, you know what? That's, that's fine. That's fine. We're just getting ready for this. Let's take a look at this new Sebastus. It already comes with targeting package and targeting unit. 
Photon beam cannon up front, built in. It's got some rail guns and some pulsar cannons. Interesting. Small energy, very short range. Annihilators over there. Custos defenders in the back. Uh, it's got some flamens. Can we get Scutum drones? I don't think we have them uh, at all. I would like me to put some Scutums on this because they are just so good. Uh, I wonder, can we actually make them ourselves? Uh, that would be fighters. And let's go design type. We have just Flamens from Empire. Okay. Uh, fair enough. So we can't, but I guess we're going to keep the Flamens on you just for interception duties. Uh, we're going to have Cookie. Do we want Reckless Officer in this one? Yeah, sure. Let's put Cookie on this one. Go Reckless. Uh, how did we build this one? So we got some Vulcans up front and the Railguns, then the Typhoons. Vulcans in the back. And there's the Photon Beam with targeting package. Hmm. We'll see. I mean, I can leave him like this, just to see how well it does. Because it's going to be a bit different. I would actually want to give you Harpoons. Maybe instead of Annihilators. Yeah. Uh, I would like you to have some more Frontal PD. But, sure. I guess we'll see how you do. You will need more of that, for sure. Reckless officer, what could possibly go wrong? Just link the harpoons together. Let me see how you fly it against, uh, let's say, a dominator. Go out there, my friend. Pop these harpoons. Targeting package and ITU is, I think, gonna go well together. Now, the other one was more... Maybe more tanky? We'll see. Anyway. Okay, so it's got... Is that anti... That's railguns popping. Okay, definitely did get the overload with the railguns and all that stuff. And... Okay, so these are anti-armor. Yeah, you know what? They're doing their job. They're definitely doing their job. He's kind of hard flux, high flux, but uh, otherwise doing acceptably well. If we had the Scutum drones, I think it would be just perfect. But it will do for now. I think it will do. Good. So at least we have one more like heavier ship in there. Not exactly the heaviest out there. It's not supposed to be a heavy ship, but it's uh, still better than what we have. All right. And I believe we have our first hegemony group popping up over here. And everybody's going for it. There's the other one. Let's pop in here, join battle. Oh my god, that's so many. So many ships from all over the place. Join battle. Uh, continue in. Can I even deploy? I can just deploy my ship. That's all. And the rest is allies. Sure, I'm gonna deploy my ship for now. Let's get out there. I mean, we do have a Paragon deployed. There's some Astrals. Some big boys, for sure. Some big boys. They did not deploy dooms, did they? These are the harbingers. Yeah, these are destroyer sized boys. Okay, it looks like they're all going for the sensor jammers for now. That's fine. I'm just uh, kind of a side observer on this one. I will help out with my ship. And then together we can go fight the other hegemony uh, fleet that has already uh, come into my system. And then there's going to be a third one at some point. Okay, that shrike is brave. That shrike is brave, but it is a high-tech shrike, you know, usually you're used to, uh... I'm just used to pirate shrikes that get shredded. But this is a high-tech one, so it could do well. I gotta be careful not to push forward too much on my own, get myself wrecked. I'm gonna be careful on that one, looks like most of the enemy is gonna be coming from this side, isn't it? Yeah, we need to get this paragon out there so it can just tank everything for us. And, uh, yeah, it's, yeah, I mean, it's good to have some allies. The Tritex are coming. Oof. You have made a mistake, bro. A slight one, yes. But you did make it. Okay, uh, you guys were gonna have to let me, uh, get out there, though. Seriously. Hey. 
Get out of here, little boys, or I'm gonna shoot you. Let me get in here. Kite, get out of here, bro. Let me let me go out here. This is the fend of my system. The defense of my system comes very uh, it's it's very important to me. It's very important to me. Oh, there's the Paragon, you know, it's up front nicely. There's their Legion. I mean, I think we're just gonna easily get through this. As long as the Paragon just tanks everything, we're fine. And uh, we can go and uh, win some... Uh, oh, very nice overload there. Very nice, I need to turn my system off. I do see the legion. The legion is looking at me, so I'm gonna pull back a bit and maybe have the legion look at the paragon, which is being looked at by a lot of ships. But that's a paragon's job, you know. They have support from these guys in the back. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, to be honest, I would like to help this paragon, but the, then my flank is kind of flanked. Yeah, let's let's help out here. I mean, they, they have mules out here. What did they expect? What did they expect? I Let's not be in the ways of the lasers. Okay, flux it up a bit, this uh, beautiful, beautiful legion that they have. Okay, that was a couple of hits on the legion. Very nice. Very nice. You came in the wrong spot, bro. Let me lower my shields, because I did get a... Uh, What's it called? I wanted to say Sebastus, but it's not it. It's the the kinetic shot anyway. Got the kinetic shot in the face. That's fine. Oh, you you dude, you're gonna you're gonna hurt. I can easily go and vent. Very nice. The Paragon is doing its job. Yeah, this this fleet is gonna melt. They do have some dominator burning in here. That's fine. Let's uh, let's focus on that Legion. I am. At 100%, I'm gonna go in here and let's start fighting. Get my systems up. Let's get the harpoons going. Oh, the overload is there. The harpoons are gonna do its job. And easy money, boys. That legion is just dead. I think you guys can brawl over there. I'm gonna go play with my boy Dominator up here. He needs to learn about our Lord and Savior, which is. I don't know, there's another Dominator. Maybe I shouldn't uh, be playing with that many Dominators at the same time. He can potentially outrange me. But... Oh, I'm out of Harpoons, though. I can outgun you. Easily. You see, I'm one of the best officers that this uh, side of the sectors has ever known. I have all of the... Pretty much all of the... Pretty much all of the combat skills. Pretty much, but not quite. Alright, start poking. Let's start poking. I see some income in there that I can nicely maneuver myself and turn it off at 2%. Let's go. Good. Okay, there's more Dominators incoming. That's fine, but the battle has been won. The battle has been won, and we definitely want to kill you guys. We are not letting you escape. Oh no. And as you can see, with uh, so many allies popping in, I couldn't uh, I couldn't get any of my other ships in. I mean, I could get a frigate. That would have been all. Uh, okay, that's not nice there. Let's start poking. Let's start poking and prodding. Oh, yes. Melt. Melt. Oh, in the maker's fire. This is glorious. This is indeed a glorious battle. Let's start pumping. Let's start pumping. That Harbinger is gonna have some issues if it doesn't uh, do his thing properly. And he is just trying to run away. I don't think I can catch up to him. These guys are just ignoring them fleeing, but I, I would like to go... If I can catch up that Dominator. Dominator is a slow ship, you know? So I should have a chance to catch it up, especially if I use my systems to get out there. Don't let him flee, boys. Don't let him flee. There you go. He's trying to turn around to get out of here. Go for him. Go for him. Burn him. Burn him, boys. Let's freaking go. Good job. Okay. I think 
and claim victory. Uh, yes, let's join the pursuit. There's, they still have the huge tanker and all that stuff. I'm gonna have my second in command. Boys do this, you guys go. And that's all but one shuttle dead. Yeah. Pick through records. Some heavy armaments as well. How unfortunate. That is one fleet defeated. There's another fleet. This one has two legions. So, less stuff, definitely. Let's get that level up. More flux dissipation. Why not? <laughs> I did say we're gonna be quite the commander at the end of this. Uh, I want to go repair if at all possible. You guys go fight. Uh, I'm just gonna quickly repair my ships. I'm gonna go quickly uh, store all of my weapons. And you might have noticed, but this this episode it's gonna be all about fighting. It's gonna be all about fighting. You know what? Let's just get in there. We can do this. We don't need the allies on this one. We can do this. Yeah. Oh, damn. Oh, no, they actually got in. They did get in. So I can, again, only deploy my ship. Fair enough. This one, this time, no Paragon. But these are my second Legion ships over here. Do one those. The Tritag brought in one Astral, which is definitely going to help. But this time around, we do not have a Paragon to tank for us. Which is slightly worse, but still... Pretty good, I gotta admit. You guys are just going for this, right? Sure. Let's go. Let's go. That's the second fleet that's gonna bite the dust. And then the third one, I don't think has arrived into the system yet. Would you please get out of my way, dudes? Fine. Let me just speed past you. Don't want to collide with that poor Astral over there. And let's get in. Actually, I have a phone call, so I'm gonna have to stop for just a second. All right, let's continue with this fight. Sorry about a slight pause. I mean, you guys are not even gonna notice it. It's been a couple of minutes. <laughs> Cause, yeah, know, we're, we're fighting anyway out here. Uh, it's fine. Good thing everything can be cut out, right? Right. Well, we're definitely catching all of these, and there's their legions. They definitely do not have a hammer, cause all of this is gonna melt. That is just garbage. And then there's the legions. And the legions do want to stand behind something and send their fighters out. Unless they're built in such a way as to be tanks. Which, I don't know if AI... I mean, sometimes AI will go and just, you know, have a legion burn into your face and then die. But, uh, as you can see, these things are all just gonna perish out here. Like, there's, there's no question. As we hold the line over here... There is no question that these guys will just die. Although I shouldn't be too cocky in getting too far out there, because, uh, as I said, the legions, first and foremost, they are fighter carriers. And if they carry some really solid bombers, well, that can hurt. I will actually pull back a bit. I don't want to get out of the way over here. I'm going to stand with my uh, friendly Ixens over here. And we can chill together. All oh, these Ixons are going with lasers. Ah, there's the strike, you can see. I think my uh, drones did well over there. Okay, I am almost at 100... I am at 100% now. Let's, let's start poking this Legion. Let's get some Harpoons in there as well. Let's see how what your answer is going to be. Your answer is going to be the other Legion coming into my face? Probably. Okay, I have to turn it off, but that's one Legion down. Let's go, boys. Now, let me just pull over here. I'm gonna give that Sebastus a chance to get in here. And yeah, we have no points to get my own ships in here. Definitely not. Uh, so, I guess all of the brunt of the work is gonna be done by my allies, really. And to be honest, I'm fine with this. Okay, let's get our flux down and let's start working on you, bad boy. Oh, this legion is legion is gonna melt soon. It's doing good killing my harpoons, but that's about it. Yep, system down. That's both of the legions down, and now it's just busy work dealing with all of this. I have a feeling the empire ships truly are slightly too powerful for uh, what they can offer. 
Let's go. Melt that thing and turn it off. 2%. That was kind of close, actually. But it was worth it. I mean, the elite package on this ship is just glorious. I gotta admit, it is just glorious. It does, it does its job so extremely well. The flux dissipation is amazingly well done. Uh, it's just fun to fly because it's also fast and all that. I think I have found my capital ship for for this whole thing. Like seriously. Oh, that's gonna be a dominator trying to run away again. Oh, none of that. Full assault forces. <laughs> Not that I am actually controlling anybody. So I guess I'm gonna be, have to be the one doing the full assault. Oh, you guys are gonna melt. There you go. But I am uh, waiting for you. I don't care for little guys if they get out, but I am waiting for you. Okay. I see you're trying to shoot over here. Well, you wanna go mano a mano? Look, I even have some harpoons left. Not that I needed them. Not that I needed them. Are you slightly overdriven there? You're going quite ham. Okay. Uh, I think anything that really needs to die has died. I guess we can just go autopilot, see if these mules perish, mules of perish over here. You can say that the Empire is doing the brunt of the work over here. The tri tech sure, is helping, but... You know, it's our second legion men that are doing all the crazy work. Hell yeah. Go, boys, go. I mean, that Shrike definitely is helping out, but in the end, we got this. Good job. Claim victory. That's the second one done. You see, we even have... Oh, this Paragon. This Combat Redden has dropped quite a lot. We will definitely join the Pursuit. Uh, and we will have our officers go hunt them down. A couple of them ran away. Can't get a legion out of it. If we could, I would actually take it and, you know, just bring it home. But for now, that's the second one done. Alright. Oh, w excuse me? What? You sneaked in, didn't you? That's not nice. That is not nice. Sneaking from the other side. That's not something we agreed upon, my friends. Uh, sure, let's put all of this in here. We got some heavy armaments, why not? And uh, our ships should be completely repaired. I'm gonna chill over here and defend. And if you wanna engage... Actually, I should not have let it engage. That was probably stupid. Because they can do a lot of damage to it. Do I wait for a second? Yeah, there we go. Let's get some more people in here. Join the battle. Continue. I can again just deploy myself. <laughs> really? You know why this is unfortunate? Because these guys are going to have a chance to destroy my station easily. My station is not very good. Uh, I should have probably not have let... Uh, not have waited for all these guys. Alright, uh, let's just go autopilot so I can... Uh, See what's happening over here. I guess these guys can be a distraction. But that is... Uh, that's three conquests. Nasty. Yeah, and they're going for the station. The station so far is doing acceptably well, but how long? You know? How long? As, as long as these guys can provide distraction. Which is not that much distraction. We definitely... I mean, we are upgrading the station, right? So there is that. Yeah, you guys... Uh, you guys are doing... Okay for now. Okay, those are gonna get destroyed. Where's my ship? It's coming. Okay. Uh, let's unpause. Let's get off of autopilot. I need to start engaging these guys before they destroy my uh, station. Can't really have that. Those guys are not going to melt as easily as we have melted pirates in the past. Mm, but so far, my second legion boys are blocking nicely. Could you please get out of my way? Dude, I'd appreciate that. Okay, me. Let me get there. I want to help. Ooh, you have overloaded. 
let's uh, see if I can get some harpoons out there. Okay, I cannot pull too far ahead, because otherwise I'm going to get myself into an uh, unenviable position. Mm, I need to fight you. This is not a good place to be. There is too many of them. Yeah, okay, okay. I need to I need to deal with some of these falcons over here. Otherwise, uh, I'm gonna have issues. The fact that my station still hasn't died completely, it's nice. Is that a conquest dead? Very nice, boys. Very nice. Good job. That was the work of all these Ixens and Sebastas and all that stuff. Good. Good, good, good. Very nice. And is the other one running away? No, it's here. It's Yeah, it's here. That one already got hurt. Perfect. Uh, let me start hurting all of you. Let me start hurting all of you. That you are out here. Is that the other conquest dead? Well then. I gotta admit. I gotta admit. I think the Astral is doing a good job over here. Just getting uh, all the stuff going in here. You know what? Oh, I I was like, I'm gonna turn this off. I was like, nope. I will overload. I will overload. I gotta say, yeah, it's probably the Astral and then all the missiles that are getting all the overloads. Yeah, all three conquests are dead. Okay, I gotta admit, my allies are doing a great job. Now, Griffin out there. I love a Griffin. You know, I know that a lot of people are like, hey, Griffins, crappy ships don't want them but they're not made to be out front line but if you put if you can put them behind some of more your more tankier ships oh they do so well their missile support I mean you probably have noticed I like missile ships missile ships might be my favorite ships 100% I want missiles on my ships it's how it is and if I can't get them well then I uh, that makes me sad all right you turn us off. Dominator are dead. I'm coming for you, Griffin. Now, once you get to them, they will melt quickly. Yes, but if you can have them behind your ship, then they can do gloriously well. Trust me. And that should be the third fleet destroyed. Thank you, allies. Thank you, second legion officers. You've done an amazing and glorious job out here. Now, I don't know if I can actually get through this one, though. Because these guys have some OP shields. Monitors. Monitors and brawlers. Fun ships. Fun ships. As you can see, so strong of a shield that even Kai I can't get. But, I got him just before he would escape. Let's go. Yes, we do want to join the pursuit. Uh, let's go again. You guys... Pursue, kill, the hegemony invasion. Pick through the wreckage. Very nice. That should have, they should have been defeated now. And Tritac is paying me for killing ships in my own uh, sector. So that's amazing. No points out of that. Unfortunately. The station should be repairing now, although actually it did it did quite well. Let's go to storage, drop all of these and the extra fuel that we have from all of those that we've been getting. Holy balls. Now that is pretty amazing. Also, we're getting some uh, supplies, which is nice. Okay. Well. Wow. Okay. That is a bigger boy. Uh, I need you guys helping out. What? That's the fourth fleet. That has five conquests. A legion. All right. Okay. They are. They're coming. I need to. Yeah. I need to wait. I need help over here. I need all these guys coming in, and then I go in here. Ashkor Station might die. That's five conquests and a legion and a bunch of Moras. One dominator. Whew. Well, these guys have really low combat readiness by now. Really low. We do have a Paragon in. So that's acceptable. The problem is going to be, I won't be able to get anybody else in here. 
Uh, okay. So, we might lose this fight. We're gonna lose this station. Because these guys, this is a fresh fleet. And uh, all of these guys are already having malfunctions. Because their CR is so low. 12% CR on that one. Like, the Paragon's got 13% CR. You know, it's a strong ship, but... Uh, I should have gone there myself. Should have tried fighting over here myself. Okay, that's the, like that's like the fourth fleet now. Um, I was told there was gonna be three fleets. This is the fourth one now. So what is this whole shenanigans business crap over here now? I don't appreciate that. Okay, there's more boys that have actual okay CR, so it's fine. The problem is going to be, even if you lose a lot of these ships, I don't think I'll be able to get my reinforcements in. And I don't think I can stand against conquests. But I can outmaneuver conquests, potentially. If I can get around them with this ship. Because, you know, that's that's how conquests hurt the most. And really would have been helpful if you got those Astrals in here right now with a tri -tac. That actually would have been helpful. But, oh well. Defense of the Ash Core. Here we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Go for this one. Boys, go for this one. 100%. It has made a critical mistake to turn its ass towards us. Melt it. Just melt it. Okay. Let's not get too excited. We have to kill it before it can do anything. That was a mistake, my friend. That was a mistake. Thank you. AI. I don't know why they turn around, but a conquest that turns its ass around to the enemy. Well, you see what it happens. You see what it happens. Conquest is a terrifying ship from up front, but in the back, no. Not at all. I see you have salamanders. I hate you already. You have to perish. There you go. Okay. Station, yeah, it's taking damage over there. It's taking damage. They should have uh, two more conquests somewhere out there. And one more legion, I think. So, uh, this is gonna be painful. I did use most of our harpoons, I think, as well, in that engagement. Okay, that's a mer. Hmm, you know what? What if I do something silly like this? Turn around over here and go here for you. Because I kind of want to kill your support capabilities. I mean, yes, exactly that. My station is still alive. And he's going to start being able to use lasers to fire from afar. Which is great. These guys are still just chilling back here, not doing anything useful. Mm -hmm. I could actually get my own reinforcements in now, if I wanted to. If I wanted to, I would like to bring maybe Ardea in first. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna wait a bit. Uh, if I could also, I would like to kill you. Uh, but I'm being flanked now by you. So, and I, that was a mistake, turning my ass to the... Oh, I almost disabled it at the last second, but it didn't. But that has brought you out, hasn't it? So come, let's do this. Let's, let's go. Thank you. Yes, yes. Okay, he's spamming salamanders. I have definitely pulled this conquest away. And Paragon is battling Legion now. Okay. I want to kill you as well. 100%. And I can definitely outmaneuver any of these conquests they have. Boom. Alright. Now I can uh, pull back a bit. What is all of this over here? Oh, somebody already brought in reinforcements. And it wasn't me. <laughs> uh, I see we don't have any more reinforcement points over there. Okay, that's fine. Okay, he is burning for me. That's a level 20 officer as well. 
this could prove dangerous, especially from that support there. But let's see how well we can do. Let's see how well we can do. Okay, I am definitely outgunning you. And turn it off. At 1%, it has been turned off. So that's, that's at least good. I will start going back to my dudes. Okay, yeah, I can I can duel it. I can duel it. Definitely. But he's got some support coming in. So that's what I have to be careful of. And really, need to pull back now. Well, I still can. Turn off my uh, guns. Pull back. Yep. Keep on, keep on pulling back. And... No! Really? Oh, man, I, I went too close to the whole thing. <laughs> I went too close to the whole thing. That's that's fine. One Conquest is still fighting the battle station. The other one is way out there. That's the one that I was fighting. And that's a uh, level 20 officer. So I did well there. 100%. But now... Now I am back in business. Now I am back in business. Stop holding fire. Let's start burning in here you will perish oh yes what a beautiful ship this is holy shit I love this ship I do love me this ship very very nice oh good overload there uh, I can't really go in there for help right now I'm waiting for my uh, I'm waiting for my uh, overdrive to come back the station has taken damage on that one, but otherwise it's fine. Because I want to go fight you again. Oh yes, come on in. Show me your backside. Very nice. Uh, I am showing backside to my enemies now as well. Which is probably not the greatest idea, but again, they have done the greatest mistake that a Colossus could ever do. Turn yourself towards the enemy. Or turn your ass towards the enemy is the one I should be saying. And that's another one dead. Oh, very nice. You are fourth in Battle Legion, aren't you? Uh, yes, you are. Beautiful, beautiful paint job there. Good. Uh, looks like we're getting even more reinforcements in. Oh, amazing. That's definitely the ships we wanted. <laughs> oh, allies. Would have been much better if you brought in some Astros or something like that. But uh, that's two conquests dead. Oh, I see one incoming over there. I see it. Uh, it's gonna burn for me, so I'm actually gonna pull back while I still can. I don't want to fight the Dominator and this guy at the same time. So I'm gonna pull back to a place where my allies can help me out. Okay, that was not acceptable, but whatever. Okay, we do have our combat readiness going down. That's unfortunate. And there's the there's the third conquest. So we have these over here. So this is a level 19 officer. A level 19 officer, and I'm guessing he's going to be... Oh, that's a 14 battle legion as well. Or battle... Uh, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Okay, now... How about you go burn towards the station as well, or something like that. Do something silly like that. And let's turn on my engines and let me start brawling a bit over here with you. Unfortunately, I do not have any harpoons left. But I did hurt you. And that's all I can ask for. That I hurt you. And I will continue fighting. Just to wait for my systems to get back in here. Okay, you know what? This is going better than I expected, really. And get my systems in there. Maybe I can even get a kill right now. And yep, at one percent, I stopped it. Okay, I can I can kill these. That one is going to be tougher. Level 19 officer on a 14 battle uh, crew battle. I never remember what is it. It's basically the 14th 14, 14th class. That's a Kopash. Yeah, whatever. The onslaughts, you know, they're their thing. Yeah, 14th battle group. No, it's 4th. Uh, whatever. 
<laughs> also, this might be a long episode with all the stuff that we're doing over here. All these battles, but you know what? It will be worth it. And you have made a mistake of turning uh, my ass. Or your ass as well. So, that will cost you, bro. That will cost you. And I can vent. Okay, that one is being very aggressive, which means I am coming for him. He's basically ran into my station. Uh, okay, that's a mistake. Let's not let's not do that. I guess I'll keep my allies occupied with that one. They have more us coming in now. All right, yeah, there's a bunch of these moras. I would love to go fight that one, but I do need to activate my systems, get out of that guy's range. And go in here. Still gonna have to keep an eye there. Because that guy is probably gonna try to burn into my face. No, oh, don't do that, don't do that. Okay, like this is gonna be fine for now. Gotta keep my shields out there. And then keep on shooting this guy. Whew, turn it off at 1%. But, that's the big boy down. Oh boy, couldn't turn it in the correct time. That hurt. That fucking hurt. Right there. Stop shooting. Take your systems off. Take your shield off. Let's go. Let's redo this. Okay. That hurt. And that was mostly the strike from those Moras. He overloaded me there, of course. But, uh, yeah, the strike there was really nasty. Now I gotta be careful. That really, really damaged my ship. And you know what? If you... Let me select this one. If you want to come in here. I will shoot you. I will shoot you, definitely. Yeah, come on in here. Let me, let me love you with my guns. Yep. You know what, AI? Sometimes you guys are great. I think that's all of their onslaughts down now. That is their onslaught. All their onslaughts down. Now you just have to deal with these freaking Moras. Ugh. Oh, we actually won. We do have critical malfunctions because of uh, uh, the prolonged deployment. It's not overload. It's no need. I think I will uh, send my battleship out. But you can say that my ship has done great over here. Let's stake this victory. Oh yes. Oh yes. We did it. We did it, boys. The Moras are out. What are we gonna pursue them? Let's have you guys go pursue. Heavy pursuit team. Got them all. I'm taking this one. This is 14th Battle Legion. You know what? I'm taking both of these. We're gonna stuck them into a storage. You know, for something like this. Recover. Pick the wreckage, get all the stuff. Boom. Are we done now? <laughs> Is this it? Is this it, boys? Is this whole thing done? No, they are still here. Hmm, but they are somewhat weak at this point, which is glorious. All right, let's go over here. Yeah, they're just small detachments, I think. Wow. All right, you know what? That was a fight but we do have more big boys now 14 battle group that's the word i was looking for <laughs> anyway thank you everybody for watching i do hope you enjoyed this mess of an episode but we went through a lot of battles we've done great things and i do hope you guys have uh, enjoyed them all and i will see you again in the next episode where i don't know maybe we'll go explore just as I wanted to do in this one. But for now, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Go crowd.